The 70s party is jumping ahead a few decades to the 1990s, one of the best eras in my opinion. With the new Netflix series, That 90s Show, take a look. Ready to party? I got the snacks. Bates got the cake. Sorry. I walked into a spider web and she got away from me. Dude, it's like his last night and you brought that nasty keg from 4th of July. I took care of this thing like it's my baby. Until I dropped it down the stairs. Just like mom did to you. Burn! The pictures. My goodness. Great. Uh, guys, that party. basement. It's Can we just a take a second? That is right. The iconic sitcom stage about 20 years, snacks. and the story continues with a new cast of characters as well as some familiar faces. And our next guest plays the stylish and cool queen of the group, Miss Gwen. Please welcome now to the Pixel 11 Morning News, Aj uh, Ashley Ofterheide. Good morning. Is that a German name? Yes, it is. I knew it. Something je ne sais quoi about it. Thank you so much for being here. It of is course. so exciting to have you. I love that 70s show. I'm so pumped for that 90s show. It's finally here. What does it mean to you to be a part of such an iconic sitcom that's been around for all these decades? It is so surreal to me. I mean, when I auditioned, I didn't know what the show was, but then I needed to do my research, mm -hmm. and I was like, okay, I'm going to look at one episode. Didn't really go in with any expectations. I immediately fell in love with it. I was like, oh, my goodness, I need to be part of this. It's hard not to. And so I auditioned. I know I had my callbacks, all of that, and then I got the role, and I was like, oh, my goodness, I'm <laughs> part of this. And I've worked with all the legacy cast and everything. Oh, my gosh. What is it like to be on set or, or to be working alongside of some of the OGs? I mean. It's insane. They are so professional. Their timing, their delivery, always there for advice. They brought us in with open arms, made us feel like family. I mean, they're all so talented. And they're funny in real life, too. Like, their yeah. characters and them. I can only imagine the debauchery that goes on that set in the best possible <laughs> way. To be a fly on the wall, really. Now, you play Gwen. So what is that like? What is she like? We saw a little snippet of her just there. Um, but I want to hear from, from your mouth directly what it's like to play her and if perhaps you have any similarities to her in your real life and you know what it was like getting into that character. I love playing Gwen. She's bold, mm -hmm. she's confident, she's a leader, she's a really, really good friend, she's really protective, she's a good sister as well, you know, she has a lot of relationships with other characters in the cast. Um, she's a riot girl, which is really cool, she's rebellious, mm -hmm. a rebel, I kind of call her like my alter ego. <laughs> I and love so that. We're like sort of similar in a way, because I'm an extrovert and outgoing, and I feel like she's the same way. And so definitely, like I sort of got to learn more about myself through the experience, I think she's really cool. Wow, so it was kind of like an, an evolution of, of acting. Ashley while getting into Gwen. I love that. Exactly. So you said you watched the original show. What did you have a favorite character? Did you have a favorite storyline? I know it's hard to choose because again it is such a great show that I to this day <laughs> will turn on or if it's on TV I I'm there. I'm there <laughs> watching it. It's such a good rewatchable show and I'm sure that 90s show will be too. But for the original one do you have any favorite characters? That's a really good question that I get asked a lot <laughs> and I can't say that I have a favorite character because they're all good for different, you know, like, depending on my mood, you know, like, if yeah. I'm in the mood for, like, a silly, maybe Fez a little bit, oh God, but then Fez. if I'm more into, like, a <laughs> mood, maybe Jackie, you know, Jackie, uh. it, it depends on the day, but I think a storyline I really liked was Kelso and Jackie, I think mm. their relationship was so mm. cute, and then the fact that they got married in real life, I mean, they're, like, the real life Kelso and Jackie, and obviously exactly. not, they're, they're very different, I actually did see Kitty in an interview once say that, one of her favorite things about being back on set to do that 90s show was watching Mila Kunis get back into character <laughs> as Jackie because she's so not her. Mm -hmm. But, I mean, it, it's just such a... I'm very jealous of your experience <laughs> getting to be with all these OGs. And the 90s was such a great era, so I'm pumped for this show. I'm a 90s baby. Full disclosure, uh, I know that you are not. Do you have, like, a favorite 90s fashion trend or maybe a favorite 90s uh, music group or singer or anything like that? That's a good question because when I was auditioning and doing my research and all that and even when I was there shooting the show I got to learn a lot more about the mm -hmm. 90s. I mean Gwen's outfits are the coolest. She is just edgy in the best way. her Green Day shirt? Oh my god, Green Day. Please. Loved it. And then I made like a whole Gwen playlist. And I a Gwen playlist? Is it on Spotify? Can you share it? Oh my god. <laughs> I love sure. it. 
I, it's I on Spotify. It. Yeah. Okay, amazing. Green. So are you a Green Day fan now? I mean, now I'm becoming a <laughs> Green Day fan. Um, when I did the audition, I had to sing Baruch Assault. So now I have like Seether ingrained in my head. And oh, Baruch Assault is on that playlist. My gosh, I love this so much. Guys, it's streaming now on Netflix. And it's, if I mean, look, she's so bubbly. Don't you want to just go watch her right now <laughs> after the news is over? But actually, thank you so much for stopping by and for sharing your insight with us on the show and Gwen, and we're so pumped for you. And like I said, you can go back in time with her and the rest of the gang right now, that 90s show, streaming on Netflix today. Now, go watch it.